Hello, everybody. That one was especially for you, the angry unboxing nerd Mike Tapp. This video is because of you. You were nice enough to order me a subscription box, actually, of your discretion. You could have ordered me anything. I sent Mike a collector's case back in December, early January, because it was a Pokemon crate. And it was full of party supplies, and I wasn't having it. But he said his kids enjoyed it. So I sent it to him, and I said, don't, you know, pay me for it. Just find me a case of anything and surprise me. I like the surprises. He was nice enough to know by watching my videos. I'm a wrestling fan from way back in 81 with the Road Warriors, and wrestling was real. Yeah, anyways, I got the Slam Crate for... I guess this will be March 2017. Um, I don't know the theme of this crate. I know there is a advertised Seth Rollins t-shirt, so I'm excited for that. Other than that, I don't know. I know they put some pins in it, uh, some figures, some other novelty things. I think it, this case would catch on. If they would do the collector's case idea and put random autographs in it. I mean, dude, you own the company. If you've got a thousand wrestlers, have them squiggle something on there. It doesn't have to be The Rock. But that, that would really drive some business. WWE, Loot Crate, Slam people. Anyways, let's open the box. You open the box, and this is what you're going to see. Okay, looks like a t-shirt. And a rock figure. If I recall the last box came with Cena medals. And now I have the rock medals. This is a uh, loot crate exclusive. The rock. It's pretty heavy. I think it's a variant because in the um, back of it, he doesn't have a t-shirt on. And this one does. Um... Got the little Brahma Bull marking. I don't know if I can open this. No, you can't really open this without not opening it. It's not like a pop figure. But anyways, that's pretty freaking cool. All right, let's check out this T-shirt. Let me take it out. And boom. What is that? Oh, okay. What is this? The Architect. Seth Rollins. Seth Freaking Rollins. You've got uh, WWE Loot Crate. There we go. It's pretty good. It's in gray. How do I look? How do I look? Do I need the beard? Long hair? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> this is hilarious. This is what they should have put inside the band box to make it funny. This would have been a, such a 90s item, but they did it in such a cool way. I'm going to do it like The Miz. There you thought that. How about that? It's a fanny pack. It's a fanny pack. Look at that. It's freaking cool. What an original idea. Slam crate. Item right there, that loot crate. Extra little pouches. I can dig it. I can dig it. Wish I had this last year or two years ago when I went to WrestleMania. That would have been cool. What do we got next? I love these pins. This is a huge pin. This is the Attitude Era Pit Championship, I believe. I know they had a couple. At the beginning, when Brett left, then they went to the, uh, they had the Smoking Skull, they had the Brahma Bull, they had a bunch of other ones. I took the plastic off for ease of view. That's pretty cool. It's pretty big. It's a good, you know, two-inch pin. Got some weight to it. Looks like I have a mystery pack. Let me open it up. Looks like we've got a couple cards. 
Maybe the Road to WrestleMania cards. I got John Cena wrestling Mr. Rollins. I got Charlotte Flair. And I got Kevin Owens. And once again, I don't know if they do put them in there, but this is a position where they could put chase cards, swatch cards, ring cards. They're not that expensive. They own the freaking company. Put some random stuff in it. I remember the first box, they put a random uh, NXT guy autograph. Okay, wonderful, but he's not even on my roster yet. But get people excited. Sell your boxes, man. Looks like that's about it. Got our little book right here. This month we have Outside the Ring with Charlotte Blair. Okay. What did your father say about your decision to be a WWE superstar? He wanted me to learn the business on his own to give me the same amount of effort and dedication to professional wrestling as I did sports growing up. What's your favorite piece of... I'm not going to go on with that. Fun facts. Sitting on a plane leaving Afghanistan and heading to Dubai. That's what she's doing right now. Favorite exercise in the gym. Back to co-op. Current favorite song. Scars of You Beautiful by Alicia Cara. Whatever. Cool poster. Undertaker. Boom, 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 boom. Cool. And on the back, it has our items. It has the t-shirt, the rock figure, little wrestling cards, the belt, and the pin. Three seconds. And it's got this an advertisement for the Tops Trading Card app where you can unlock something special, but I want a real card. A real card. Anyways, Mike Tap, thank you so much. The rest of the Tap family, Lisa Tap, I'm not gonna call her what you call her because it's disrespectful. Happy Tap, Junior Tap, Little Girl Tap, all the taps running around. Tapful happiness. I'm blabbing now. Anyways, thanks, Mike. Catch you again. Later, peeps. Bye.